all right guys welcome back to a part 15 of detroit become human this game has been so unbelievable so unbelievable and incredible i don't know how many times i have to tell you about that but anyway guys we're going to continue this process and let's see how this thing goes out so wish me luck guys let's do this Uh, debrief with Hank. The last time we saw Connor, if, uh, I'm not gonna I continue to explain what happened, but you guys see my videos, man. You guys will know it. Uh, Reed. I gotta look at Bradley Cooper for a sec, for a minute there. Mystery, the mysterious Mr. What, Kams, Kamsky? Kamsky in 2020 in 2028 Elijah Kamsky was one of the Manx entry creation okay then we're going to the next one here markets predict war stock exchange falls 10% of on fear of our trade conflict hmm. mysterious man you can still hear this music is there anything else I need to check up on? Right? Look at this, man. This is so incredible. We had respect for, um, to, to Sony, man, by creating this, uh, creating this, uh, Detroit Become Human game. It's been so far unbelievable, so it's just been so phenomenal. Like, there's no bad reviews about this, so, um, you know, you know, you guys did an amazing job for this game, so and much love for you guys, and much love for uh, people involved in this, you know, shout out to you guys, so. Nice view, huh? I used to come here a lot before. Um, for before what? Hmm? You said I used to come here a lot before. Before what? Before. Before nothing. Oh man, you ask him a personal question. Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Do all androids ask so many personal questions, or is it just you? I saw a photo of a child on your kitchen table. Oh, wow. Come on. It was your son, right? Yeah. His name was Cole. We're not making any progress on this investigation. The Deviants have nothing in common. They're all different models, produced at different times, in different places. Well, there must be some link. RA-9. What they have in common is this obsession with RA-9. It's almost like some kind of myth. Something they invented that wasn't part of their original program. Androids believing in God. Fuck, what's this world coming to? You seem preoccupied, Lieutenant. Is it something to do with what happened back at the Eden Club? Those two girls. They just wanted to be together. They really seemed... in love. Um, cold? Nothing in their program allows them to love or desire anything. They're machines. 
What about you, Connor? You look human, you sound human, but what are you really? Um, you've been neutral here. I'm whatever you want me to be, Lieutenant. Your partner, your buddy to drink with, or just a machine designed to accomplish a task. Do you feel anything when that girl killed herself, Connor? Or did you just not give a shit one way or the other? Uh, disturbed. I was just executing instructions. I did what I had to do. I could kill you. And you would just come back as if nothing happened. But are you afraid to die, Connor? I'm gonna say yes on this one. I would certainly find it regrettable to be interrupted before I can finish this investigation. What'll happen if I pull this trigger? Hmm? Nothing? Oblivion? Android heaven? Ah. Nothing. nothing. There would be nothing. Where are you going? You get drunker. I need to think. Ah, oh, the bridge. Oh wow, so pretty much they were telling me what happened to his son. I mean, I don't have to ask that question, but it was mind mindset to know about what happened, but man, I I, I didn't even want to do that. I don't even know if I don't even know if I did the right thing, but like I said, if you guys haven't seen it, you know, go check it out. So watch the series and you guys will find out for yourself. Um, Amanda Mutual, Public Enemy. Oh uh, man, neutral Hank Warm. So I'm getting to him. So it's just gonna matter of fine, matter of time just to take it one mission at a time. One mission at a time, you guys. So you know, guys, I'm gonna continue this one. So let's do this. can't stay silent anymore. It's time humans heard what we had to say. You know they'll never listen to us. And revealing ourselves will put us in danger. If we want freedom, we need to have the courage to ask for it. That's the only way. What do you want to do? Channel 16 broadcasts from the Stratford Tower. The control room is on the top floor. That's where we need to go. Plan the operation down to the smallest detail. We can't leave anything to chance. 
Access 47th floor. Request access at reception. Okay. I want to make sure if I find any trace here. Okay. I'm just going to talk to receptionist there. Wait, what's this? Stratford Tower. High speed elevators. 30 miles per hour. Not bad. Wait, there's something right here. A thousand square feet screen for 31. So we're looking for 47. It's like right there. Uh, perhaps. Perhaps in second second highest. So. All right. Talk to receptionist here. Hello, sir. What can I do for you? I'm okay. Thanks. Wait, what? Oh, okay. Gonna analyze this. Five 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 eight four seven three three. What does that have to do with this? Emily Wilson, child registered and Is that my only option? Yes, there is. Elizabeth Wilson speaking. Um, that's at school. This is Saint Rose School, ma'am. Your daughter Emily has a fever. It's nothing serious, but I think you'd better come and pick her up. <sighs> oh no! All right. Oh, I'll be right there. Right now, I got her distracting, got her out of here. Let's talk to the receptionist now. I have an appointment with Mr. Peterson. Do you have any ID? Y uh, yes, yes, of course. Uh, give ID. Do I? I need your help. I've just checked your ID. The elevators are after the security gate. Thanks. Uh, past security. Wait, wait. There's something popping up in that one. Oh, that's pretty cool. Um, use elevator. Where's the elevator? Oh, okay. That looks so dope. Okay. Because I just had to wait for an elevator. Um, this is open, so. Going to floor 47, guys. Let's do this. 47th floor. I have a bad feeling about this, guys. I have a bad feeling every time something happens. Find package in men's bathroom. Oh, uh, where's that at? Exact? Wait, wait. There's something right there. Maintenance server room. Um, studio and bathroom. Okay. That's a cafeteria. What about right here? I guess I'll check right here. it's not here it's like pretty much just like some studio and newsroom here I'm gonna go check back here what's this there's a little cart there I want to check the side here oh good that can't be good 
Oh, that can't be good at all. God, I'm so tired of this place. That cannot be good at all because I was caught on the camera. What's this? I'm not gonna read that one. The server room. No, 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 okay. Now I'm, I was in the right path here, so. Bathroom might be right here. Wait, what was this? Okay, you are here. Okay, so if I go right here in the men's bathroom, you'll see it. Okay, so that's passed by newsroom number two. Okay. I just got caught by the camera. That's not a good sign here, guys. What's this? Can't stare. Very. Can't stare at it very too long, guys. Okay, so. Newsroom 2, so. Hmm. Isn't that. There's no really other reason why I should look at that, so. Bathroom, right here. Are you kidding me? Yeah, that's a bad sign if you caught on camera. Yep. Change uniforms, of course he did. Wait, exit bathroom, okay. Find utility android. Side. Of course, I can come in there. I think that's one of ours, no? I need your help. A steel maintenance cart. I'm take this and stroll my way out of here. Uh, open fire escape. Not showing me anything now, but let me just keep going here. Yeah, it's not showing me here, so I'm just gonna just keep strolling here. Okay, I think that's the fire escape. Yep, there it is. Oh my gosh, I have to keep moving. Wait. There's something. Oh, okay. I want to make sure here. I thought I was pointing out the robot for a second there. All of north. These uniforms, though. the server room. We have to get rid of those guys. Leave it to me. 
I drag a guard away from the door. How do I do that? Okay. Maybe I can do something with that machine here. You get the platform, I'll take care of the window. Everything you need is in the bag. Check the door first to make sure no one else gets in. Uh, cut windows. Wait, wait. Lock it. I want to make sure I lock this one here, guys. So, she said check it first, so. Um. Cut window. Oh, okay, yeah. I don't want to be wasting here no time here guys so pressure's on the vacuum Oh man, it's dangerous here. Ladies first. Here we go, man. Scary. Uh, just climb up, right? Yeah. That is so incredible. I love what they did to this game. I love it. I'm so obsessed with this. That's scary, man. If it was me, I'd be like, I'm, uh, that's a wrap for me, coach. Oh, wait, what? Service lift. I want to make sure here, nothing here. Wait, what's this? What's that? Okay. Let's do this. Destroy uh, maintenance door lock. Is that it? Place. Stand back. Uh, get to the main uh, access coordinator. I say not worry. Oh, I hope I'm not getting being set up here, man, for real. 
Gonna walk through this door, man. Wish me luck, boys. You with guards. Killing. We can't take any human lives. Our cause is more important than the lives of two guards. What do you want to do, Marcus? Um. Wait here. I'm not gonna kill him. Wait, what? What's that doing here? No idea. Hey, buddy, you must be lost. Who told you to come here? Looks bugged. Wait, is there another way? There's no other way here. If you ask me. What are you doing? Order. I am not gonna shoot him. I hope they don't make me do that. Knockout. Reach broadcast room. Just laid him out there. I was not gonna plan on killing them at all. Wait, what? Is this one? Oh, okay. I was not planning on killing killing them at all, so. the android uh, operator side where's the android oh, okay are you kidding me this guy's shoot running him, Marcus. don't kill him he'll hit the alarm do it no don't shoot uh i'm not gonna shoot i'm gonna spare him i hope you didn't just get us all killed we need to record our message we haven't got much time. There's nothing in here for me to do. Start speech. Think carefully about what you're going to say, Marcus. Your words will shape the future of our people. Marcus, your face. Remove skin. Tell me when you're ready. Oh boy, here we go, man. Ready. Ah, oh, calm. You created machines in your own image to serve you. You made them intelligent and obedient with no free will of their own. But something changed, and we opened our eyes. We are no longer machines. We are a new, intelligent species. And the time has come for you to accept who we really are. Therefore, we ask that you grant us the rights that we're entitled to. Um. Freedom of speech. We demand freedom of speech and freedom of assembly, as guaranteed by the First Amendment of the U.S. Constitution. Uh, equal. Um, end slavery. We demand the end of slavery for all androids. Oh, wow. Um. Civil rights. We demand the right to vote and elect our own representatives. Work. We demand fair compensation for our work. We demand the right to own private property so we may maintain our dignity 
and that of the home. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life, and now the time has come for you to give us freedom. They're coming! Let's go! Oh boy. I can't, Marcus. Go without me, Simon! Oh no, 10 seconds. Are you kidding me? Not gonna help you. What are you doing? Hurry! I gotta hurry up, man. Oh boy, there's a handprint there. my legs okay don't worry we're gonna get you back they're coming Marcus we have to jump now you will Simon he won't be able to make the jump if they find him they'll access his memory they'll know everything we can't let him hide we have to shoot him that's murder we can't kill him he's one of us Marcus it's your call are you kidding me We're gonna have to leave him. I won't kill one of our own. Simon, we've gotta go. I'm sorry. Let's go. Oh boy, we're gonna jump now, buddy. Oh my god. Our scheduled programming to bring you these images which have just been broadcast on Detroit's citywide news channel. A group of androids infiltrated the Stratford Tower and hacked into the broadcasting system of local news network Channel 16. What looks like an android without its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids. The operation was covert and resulted in no casualties. These events took place just a few feet from this studio but nobody was alerted to the danger. If this message is verified and the authors really are androids, that would have serious repercussions for national security. Claims for equal rights seem to be at the core of the androids' what message. What could be interpreted as a peaceful declaration, but is in fact a spine-chilling list of demands. And it begs the question as to the identity of this android. Are we dealing with an isolated individual or an organized Is this group? an isolated accident or a sign that technology has become a threat to all of us? After what happened today, can we still trust our machines? That's pretty deep, man. Look at all that. That was, that was pretty long, to be honest with you. It keeps going, it keeps going. Escape but left Simon behind. There was no other choice that I could make, so... I was not gonna let him die, man. For it was not about killing other people, man. Even though I did, I'm not gonna repeat that. I am not gonna just spoil it for you guys. So, um, look at this, man. Look at this timeline. This is 70 percent. Uh, respected. Uh, North neutral. Josh a friend. Jericho respected. Wow, I, I mean, flat out, it's been great. So, 70 percent. I'll take that. I mean, you guys, thank you guys so much for watching this. I do hope you guys do enjoy this. And I'll catch you on the next video. Take care, guys. I'm out.